Good morning. The chairman of the board for the Friends of the National War World II Memorial, Josiah Bunting Ambassador, is the Honorable Serhi Kavot Krivanos. And the honor. We gather this morning to commemorate the anniversary of the day the Allies formally accepted the uncondition unconditional surrender of the armed forces of Nazi Germany and the end of Adolf Hitler's Third Reich. But more importantly, we're here to remember and honor all those brothers and sisters in arms who made that victory possible. It was through their bravery and dedication to cause that America and our allies found the will to defeat the forces of fascism. He now serves as chairman of the Friends of the National World War II Memorial. Our One of the great things about an event like this is that it brings us together in our basic and elemental role as Americans. There is no political complaining. There are no Republicans or Democrats. There are no critics, political critics and other kinds of critics. There are only Americans who use an opportunity like this to repledge our determination that the sacrifices of those we honor today shall not have been in vain. Colonel Frederick Clinton entered the Army in 1943 at the age of 16. A lot same age as you, a lot of high school children. I call you children, I'm sorry. Representing the friends of the Nationals and the United States Air Force, our veterans, Dr. Jack Goldstein and Mr. Lee. 